David Berlin, Tech Shakedown number six. I'm going to show you how Kodak's online photo gallery is incompatible with Microsoft's newest operating system, Windows Vista. I'm David Berlin with ZDNet. When Microsoft first came out with its Windows Vista operating system, a lot of people had questions about whether it might be compatible with their existing software. But one question a lot of people didn't think to ask was, is it compatible with the websites that they frequent? One website that's having its share of difficulties with Microsoft's Windows Vista is Kodak's online photo gallery. Like a lot of online photo sites, Kodak's gallery allows you to upload pictures either one at a time or in a batch mode. Obviously, if you have a lot of pictures to upload, doing it one at a time can be pretty painful. So batch modes let you upload lots of pictures all at once. Now, in the case of Kodak's photo gallery, the feature works really well with Windows XP. But in the case of Microsoft Windows Vista, it's got a lot of problems. In order for Kodak's batch feature to work, you have to download a plugin. The first time I tried to use Kodak's batch upload feature, I was logged into Microsoft Windows Vista as a standard user, and I was using the built-in browser, which is Internet Explorer 7, and it simply didn't work. When I brought it to Kodak's attention, they sent me this 15-point list on how to get it functioning. But even that didn't work. As a standard user of Microsoft Windows Vista, the only way I could upload my pictures to Kodak's online photo gallery was a very painful one at a time. So then, desperate to find a solution myself, I thought maybe the batch mode might work if I was logged into Windows Vista as an administrative user. And that's what I tried next. Now, things got better, but not by much. The first time I went to upload a batch of pictures to Kodak's online photo gallery when logged in as an administrative user to Windows Vista, it installed the plugin and everything went swimmingly. But the problem was, after that, the next time I went to upload some pictures, it asked me to install the plugin again, and again, and again, and again. Unfortunately, that's not the way a plugin is supposed to work in Internet Explorer 7. Even worse, there's no clear statement on Kodak's online photo gallery that says that its batch mode is incompatible with Windows Vista. So who's to blame for this mess? Is it Kodak's fault because when they first saw Microsoft Windows Vista coming out, they didn't bother to do adequate testing and find out that their software was incompatible with it? Or is it Microsoft's fault because any software that runs on Windows XP should be forwards compatible with Microsoft Windows Vista. And in the bigger picture, is this an indicator that just like with Microsoft Windows XP, users are going to have trouble running software on Microsoft Windows Vista as a standard user? Shaking down Kodak and Microsoft for problems that simply shouldn't exist this long after Windows Vista has shipped. For ZDNet, I'm David Berlind.